Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be doing a video on how to set up a leopard gecko's terrarium, or cage, in other words. Oh, one second. Okay. Well, first, you want to get your gallon, of course. I have a 10 gallon right now, because I haven't got to pet Spart, and I haven't gotten any 20 gallons yet, because I know he's big enough for one, and he needs some more space. So... First, what you want to put in is your substrate. I do not recommend sand because it causes impaction on on the gecko. I know I have a friend that lives like the street next to me, I guess, uh, and he has his leopard gecko in sand, and it is as small as a baby, and it's five years old. And he only feeds him like supposedly fourteen crickets a week, which I don't recommend doing. I just feed him at mealworms for a day. So yeah, well first you're gonna wanna put in your substrate. I have erupted carpet. So yeah, let's put that in. Ah, sorry. Uh, it's all bumpy. Oh, I need to turn it around. Nope. Other way. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just need to find the right way on how to put it in. So, yeah. You have your ripped carpet in now. And next, what you want to put in is a hide. I have this rock hide. It's, actu it's actual rock. It's very big and heavy. It has an entrance on the back and on the front. very big one in the front. And this allows him to get on top of it and just lay out because there's like groupy stuff on it. Sorry if it's dirty. I have calcium all over it. And you want to put this on their, I'm going to say warm hide, or warm hide, warm side. Uh, one sec. Like, like that, and as you can see, there's a bunch of space there. So yeah, that's where you put your hide in. I put it on the warm side. And next, what you want to put in is your calcium dish, which I have right here. I just use a little bottle cap from a vitamin water bottle, and I just put it right there. But I need to fill it up because it doesn't have that much left in it. And next, what you want to put in is your thermometer. I have two. One back there and one here. I put this... Uh, I put this one right there behind him. As you can see, that. Uh, so yeah, it is 75, but it hasn't gone up yet. Or hasn't reset itself. And next, what you next what you want to put in is your water dish. As, as you can see, I just cleaned by now, and it's all dry and all goopy again. So I need to dry that off again, and get all the powder out of it. Hmm. All right, and you're gonna want to put that right there on the right side corner, bottom right side. The next one I want to put what you want to put in is your decor or ornaments. Ornaments. <laughs> uh, I don't I don't know what I'm doing right now. I just no. Uh, you want to put in your decorations inside the inside the cage. I have this. This is a little plastic plant that came from him or her, I should say. And I'm going to put that in right there, that wood log in Gypsy's cage. So yeah, I'm going to put this Ah, sorry, one sec. And I have to fold it sideways. So yeah, you have that. And yeah, 
And next I have a Repti hammock that I got off of LLL Reptile. So yeah, I'm going to show you how to set it up right now in a sec. So what you're wanna gonna do, or what you're gonna do is, you're gonna, yeah, one sec. You're you're gonna wanna put this corner. You're gonna wanna put that corner right next to the corner of the, right next to the corner of the page. And as you can see, you will have the other two straps that still need to be suction cupped on to the side. I'm going to put mine up there. I'm going to make it a tall one. And then I'm going to put the other one. Alright. Right there. So yeah, I have the Repti hammock in right now. So you can get a little bit closer to the light. So yeah, that's it's kind of in a bigger slant. I need to lower this one down one sec. So yeah, like that. Oh no, <laughs> I'm sorry, people. There you go. All right. Yeah, like that. So yeah, like that, and have it not that steep, like not not steep, like. Like, have it look like I do, so you can just stand there and lay down. It might look steep on the camera, but it's kind of flat. So, yeah, what I do for more decor is I get A cartons, and I kind of stack them up on each other. One sec. Like that. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I want to have to do like that. I'm going to have one like that. I'm going to move my calcium over to that corner back there. No, not going to work. I'm just going to put it like, like that. You get my point. Yeah, you can just stack them up on, on top of each other if you want to. As you can see, I have a little... I have that can go over there. But I'm going to take that off and I'm just going to put it over the water bowl. Because I have lamps for heat. Ah. So yeah, uh... That's decor. I can add more like that, but I'm not going to because I actually want him to have more room and not just have to climb over his stuff and yeah. So next, what you want to what you're gonna put in is your other thermometer, which I have right here. It came with the Desert Kid. It is it is a Ziller hydrometer and temperature gauge. Oh, no, not temperature gauge. It's a thermometer and hydrometer. So yeah, one second I need to go get my tape because the sticky came off of the back. And for more decor, you can you can put in like different stories like I did, but I don't have it in right now because. I just don't. So yeah, if you don't have the sticky on, you're going to want to put your tape right above that circle because that's where all the 
temperature comes in and that's how it reads everything so yeah and I'm gonna put it right above the Repti hammock like that yeah I'm gonna put it like that right above the Repti hammock next you're wanna gonna or you're gonna put in your gecko which I'm gonna go get him right now he's in this box right here. Hopefully he still is. There he is. Come here, boy. There he is. Little Wiz. Wiz, Wiz K. I call him Wiz Khalifa. So. Uh, yeah. And you're gonna wanna add your gecko. Ah, I'm sorry, boy. Oh, yeah. He's just checking it out, seeing what's new, which there is nothing new because that's the same. And there he goes into his little hide because he loves his hide. Boy. I love his back tail. It's so cool. So I'm going to put that under my corn snakes cage. And I'm going to try once again with these eight cartons. One sec. Oh, I know what I can do. You're gonna want to make them smaller than that, so I'm gonna put it this like just like that. So he has a little, but other way. So, so he has little shade, and it's not, and he doesn't get that much. Light so we can sleep. So yeah, that's how you set up your gecko setup. And one last thing that you need to add is your heat. So set the heat. Oh, and for your screen, I don't put a lock on it because I have no, but because I have nothing that could. Although I should put one on because I have to rub to him again. Ah, I'm sorry, I dropped the camera. And you can just put it up like that. Oh my god, it's time already. Sorry, it's Super Bowl day. Oh crap, it is. Okay, one second. Monarch! Never mind, that's one. Sorry, my dog's barking. Even though there's nobody there, he does that a lot. So yeah, and also you're going to want to put in this. This moisture, but I don't have it in right now. Uh, yeah, so I think I'm just going to put the end of the two story again. And put this, so yeah, it's moist. Alright, so one second, I'm going to put this onto my stand. Don't drop because I wouldn't want to break my. Oh my gosh. So, yeah, as you can see, I have them on my whole stand. Sick. And I have, uh, <laughs> I have lamps for heat. One sec, I need to put this on the sides. Oh my gosh. See, I have my. Ooh, well, that's bad. I think some tape got on there. Yeah. A little bit. As you can see, I have my little heat lamp. 
which I'm gonna put over my the hide, not over the reptile hammock. 